Ashley, go get another winch. It's going to take hours, hours and hours. This is the Titan Intercontinental Ballistic Missile. Its mission, deliver a payload to a designated spot on the Earth's surface some 5,500 nautical miles away. Its warhead could level an entire city. Welcome back to Nuclear Bunker Living. It's Nick. I want to show you something over here. Look at this. If you recall back a couple of months ago, our Doberman mother, when well, she gave birth. Look at these guys over here. 100% female, all girls. The father is a half Great Dane, half Doberman, and the mother is a pure Doberman, and um, these guys are adorable. Look at this. Come on, guys. Yay! <laughs> Lovely manners. So the other population of our canines is currently 14 right now. Hello, little girl. Yeah, she's too low. She's a little cautious one. Hey. After you. This wood over here is a uh, reclaimed wood on the other habitation uh, section of the other Titan one. In the other there's uh, this is 65 year old wood. We've now recycled it. And the reason being we're building a structure over here. And we're gonna make a second attempt to open up the access portal doors in the spring but for now. We need to keep the other snow and the water from dripping down inside of the elevator shaft. So we're building this particular structure. And that's gonna basically um, be a temporary uh, solution for the next three, four, five months before we um, go with the other second attempt. With the cranes, this time we're going to have two cranes and we're going to finally open up these access portal doors and pull out the elevator car down the bottom over here. So, a lot of things happening, but we do have a, um, a gantry system which you've already seen and you're going to see exactly how we're going to continue to haul out 80,000 pounds of metal that is, you know, 40 tons of steel. So, pretty exciting. So, let's go down there. Okay, so back to nuclear bunker living. It's um, all about the 80,000 pounds of metal hauling out of the other control dome, through the lobby, up the elevator shaft, to the surface once again. Bend it a little bit more. Yeah. There you go, there you go. <laughs> To ensure a clean and working environment, Tunnel Junction number 10, which is the actual lobby area, all debris and hazardous particles are being cleaned and removed.
Pat and David are commandeering and tackling this mountain of metal that is getting ready to be hauled up through the elevator shaft to the surface. Inevitable mechanical tragedy. The winch has malfunctioned and it's just not working right now. Okay, here today we have a problem. Our winch quit working on us, so now we have to take it off the top of the elevator shaft. 
take it down, dismantle it, go get another winch. It's going to take hours, hours and hours. A little depressed. So what's the plan, man? Well, as far as I can tell, I'm going to have to slide it back over. I guess we can go from there. What we're going to have to do is push that one this way. So you want me down the other side? Yeah. On the logistical front, now we have to pull apart the winch and the entire support structure. Fishing today.
Charm. Hope. So the boys are chucking down the bigger pieces down into smaller pieces. Uh, this metal harvesting from that mountain of steel continues. And we've over 20 loads up to the surface. We've hardly made a dent. But soon, a full 360 degree view of the control dome will be visible. <laughs> 